Good. Good. Come on, buddy. Talk to me, huh? It's my fault. I overmatched us. I overmatched you. I'm sorry. I'm afraid we zigged when we should have zagged, Michael. Hey! <laughs> You're all right, huh? All right hardly seems appropriate, Michael. Look what that... that behemoth did to me. Uh, uh, yeah. Now I know what being run over by a truck really feels like. Michael, my uh, computer functions are damaged, so I can't make a diagnosis. But you sound terrible. You need a doctor. Listen, try and contact Devin or April. That's the way we gotta get out of this mess. I've sustained a good deal of damage. I'm afraid I can't contact anyone. In fact, the odds on our ability to... Kid, not now, please. Hey, there's not a taxi in sight. Pretty soon it's gonna be hot enough to melt rocks out here, pal. We gotta get you running again. I'm not sure that's possible. Well, I can't move you. It better be. All right. Let's go back to basics. Take a look at your ESB. What in the world is that? Your emergency schematic blueprint. You haven't forgotten that, have you? It's coming back to me now. That looks like Greek to me. I beg your pardon? That's just a phrase. It's just a phrase. I can't raise Michael or Kit. It's like they've vanished. I wish Michael hadn't rushed into the desert like a Bedouin. <sighs> it's all my fault. I should have waited till I knew more. Nonsense. Michael is perfectly capable of assessing the risks in this situation. I know how this must look. Me back with Garth and, and passing the information on to Michael. I... Rita, Michael believed you. So do we. Well, there's no point in standing around here waiting and wondering. I'm flying to SAC headquarters as soon as possible. April, I want you to stand by, just in the event of... Uh... I have the semi on full alert and ready to roll. Good. You'll stay with us, of course. I should go back to the hotel. I'm afraid it's more than likely Garth is suspicious of you. In fact, he may have used you to lure Michael out there. If that's true, he'll be suspicious if I don't return. And if it isn't, there's still a chance I can find something that'll help. I thought putting a barbecue together was hard. Michael, I never felt this way before. That makes two of us. I mean, so vulnerable, so... Little. Do you think it's possible I could cease to exist? If I don't get you running pretty soon... You can put money on it. Terrific. Along with everything else. Looks like... 90% of your turbine blades are shot. My turbine? Oh, goodness, without that, I'm powerless. Maybe. Maybe not. Oh, kid. If I can figure this mess out, maybe I can jerry-rig a ramjet. A ramjet? But, Michael, my exhaust system isn't designed to accommodate the kind of temperatures a ramjet will produce. Not to mention the fact that navigation will be virtually impossible. Yeah, well, we're a long way from home. We're just gonna have to take our chances. Michael? 
Yeah. I'll be right with you. Are we ready? We'll find out in a minute. Michael, I'm worried. Me too. <laughs> okay. Hang on, buddy. Here we go. Come on, buddy. Come on! So far, so good! Yes, Michael, but now the question is where? My directional equipment isn't functioning. Let's just try straight ahead. Present speed of 310 miles per hour, the odds of survival are. My odds calculator just malfunctioned. Look out, Michael, there's a mountain. It's already in arms, sir. A miracle of American technology. If <laughs> this is anyone's miracle, it's mine. Of course it is, my dear Dubois. You could walk on water if it was necessary, couldn't you? I know I've got a dozen things to do, so if you don't mind. But I do mind very much. I have a rather substantial investment to protect, and I find myself Worrying. About? You? So much depends on your success in the next 24 hours. There must be no distractions. It's one thing to witness a demonstration, quite another to learn of your personal vendetta in this matter. No one tells me how to proceed with Bebola. My mother doesn't, and you don't. Without me, you'd still be in the bush, dodging spears. Without me, you'll still be rotten in jail. So, you see, we are mutually indebted to each other. With luck, we shall continue a long and fruitful relationship. For your information, I have many men who are excellent rivals if you prove unreliable. Don't you threaten me. That's not a threat. Just a reminder. Nothing? No. Had to go with the general. Without a signed affidavit from Garth Knight detailing his plan, no one will believe it. To think that Michael may have given his life for nothing. We've got to keep hoping, praying. I've contacted the National Guard. I spoke with a Colonel Abrams. He said that... Well, that's probably him now. Devin! <laughs> Yeah,
Comet. Night Rider. Oh, <laughs> 